welcome back to the Louis Twins channel. I'm Brittany, if you're new here, hello. If you're returning, welcome back. Today, we are going to be doing a what we eat in the day as vegans. We know we did a what we eat in the day like a few weeks ago, but this is the last week of the January. So we just wanted to put out another what we eat in the day, just in case anybody else wants to get on that veganuary train. <laughs> doesn't have to just be big anywhere it can be any time it is morning time as you can tell by the way i look i think we're gonna start off with just a normal easy breakfast that we do which is gonna be a bagel and a smoothie i think we're gonna do a pineapple berry type of smoothie i realized that we never got pineapple chunks from the store which is like what but we do have pineapple juice to do the pineapple flavor so it would probably be better if you had pineapple chunks but you know you may do when you have to make them we're gonna go ahead and get that started finished making breakfast I decided to add peanut butter to this and not just butter so we can get like a little bit more protein in and also I had peanut butter so that's also why I did it I love 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 a good fruit smoothie strawberry pineapple berry anything a good fruit smoothie i'm not really into like a chocolate smoothie smoothie with oat milk i don't like milk really i've just always been weird with milk so i don't like adding milk as the base also here's another thing this is your sign if you do not like protein powder don't force feed protein powder in a smoothie i do not like protein powder i'm not gonna put protein powder in my smoothies because then it makes my smoothies less enjoyable and that is you don't let diet culture and the world you need all this protein we don't force feed food we eat foods that we like and foods that we enjoy i do not put protein powder in my smoothie because uh, for me we can implement protein in other ways throughout the day so i came on here to let you guys know that i don't like anything strawberry flavor like it's just gross to me so i made a different smoothie i made a cherry oat smoothie i also have a bagel too i just put just plain butter on mine i don't want peanut butter today that's fine too put peanut butter like something that you feel like would make it more healthier it's fine too i'm gonna go ahead and eat our breakfast and we will check in at lunch time it is later i just threw on this pink crew neck thing because like i got a little bit cold but right now we are heating up our lunch and it's like leftovers we had like a few days ago so i'm going to show you guys what we are having for well, the vegan brand beyond came out with steak tips so i've been wanting to try the beef and broccoli and my go-to is the trader joe's beefless meat that they have but literally always sold out when we go which always makes me so mad so i was like let me try this beyond steak tip and it tastes pretty good it's not as good as the trader joe's but if you want to try like a beef and broccoli or like anything with like beef or like steak tips i think the beyond would be pretty good with that so this is our leftovers it doesn't look that good but trust me it is we just made some a vegan version of beef and broccoli and then just put some rice on it so while i eat that i'm just going to be drinking this sprite zero because i literally have a soda addiction hear that crack while i eat this i'm gonna watch hulu it's this new show called web of death or something like that it's a new show so i'm going to be watching that while i eat my lunch so it is later and I'm gonna have one of these chocolate chip cookies from Whole Foods for a snack. You need to try these cookies, they are amazing. Um, they literally taste like regular chocolate chip cookies. So I'm gonna snack on this for a little bit and watch some YouTube. As you guys can hear, the onions are doing their thing. Now we gotta get this rice going because we are rice gals. We are always gonna eat rice. Recipe doesn't call for rice, we still cook in rice. We're gonna make rice and I'm gonna just do it in our pink rice cooker, of course. Thank you. 
going to assemble our, I don't know, tacos, fajitas, I don't know what they really are, but we will do a taste test for you guys. So this is our assembly line. We have the rice, the tofu pieces, the toasted tortillas, the corn, I just added some lettuce, I like to top my lettuce, some chips, and then just the onions. We washed this off before I put it up here. Let's taste this. The taco or fajita, whatever we want to call it, was really good. Rice in your tacos always, period. So now we're gonna watch something on TV, probably something reality TV because always, and just eat this. I'm probably just gonna be drinking this water back here because I keep drinking soda, so I'm making myself drink water with this. It is later and I'm hungry, so let's get a snack. And yes, I literally just ripped all my nails off, but I'm gonna glue them back on later, but snack time. I'm just gonna eat these back to nature vegan Cheez-Its. These are so good if you miss having Cheez-Its now that you're vegan and or dairy free, you can get these. These are so good. So I'm gonna eat these and edit because it is almost 11.30 and all my Swifties out there know we're waiting for midnight for Lavender Hayes music video. I'm gonna just edit until then and then 12 o'clock done. All attention is on Taylor and YouTube. And get that started. So the Lavender Hayes video is about to come out and we are super excited. We will let you guys know what we think about it. Now there's 92K of us waiting. At first it was just 85K when I first clicked on it, but it's about to be midnight. So I'm super excited, Taylor, to see the Lavender Hayes song. Even though Lavender Hayes isn't one of my favorite ones on midnight, I'm still excited for the music video. The video went off and I don't know, Taylor is a genius. She knows more than me about creating creative things and things with deeper meanings. I give it a 10 out of 10 because it's Taylor. Now we're gonna go ahead and just watch Married at First Sight while we edit a little bit. So that was what we eat in the day as vegan. Hopefully this inspires someone to go vegan, if not in January or February, or even just try some plant-based meals. Disclaimer, this is what we eat, so we're not saying you should eat this way at all to look like us, or you should just go vegan just based on what we're eating. Everyone has their own path, and you can eat how you want to, what makes you happy. This just makes us happy eating like this, so that's why we do it. Also, we didn't show us drinking water throughout the day, but we did drink some water, so make sure you have water. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss a video. We'll be back on Tuesday with a brand new video. Bye! Bye.